People around the world like to ring in the new year in a cold and invigorating way. Why there, not? There is no way I'm doing a polar <laughs> plunge. Me but uh, hey, some people do it every year. It happens right here. Uh, they're doing it in shirts, as a matter of fact. That's where Maggie Lachlan is this morning. You're not in a swimsuit. Not yet, that is. You'll have to stick around. Barry, I'd like to see you do the polar plunge this morning. Anyway, so yes, I am in shirts at the Pickwell Park pool and we're having a lot of fun. Here's our polar bear friend here. Give him a nice wave. And uh, clearly I'm getting to relive my glory days as an old lifeguard. Now, while preparations are underway for the polar bear plunge tomorrow morning, I want to talk to you all a little bit about the meaning behind this event. And of course, we have Deseret here with us to tell us a little bit about uh, what these proceeds are going to tomorrow morning. Who does this benefit? So sure. the proceeds benefit our community. 100% all the proceeds go back to providing our youth swim lessons, uh, after school care, sports, or families the opportunity to come to a gym and work out. Okay, and so maybe someone who isn't able to pay for this themselves, this gives them an opportunity, is that right? Yes, it does. It actually gives them an opportunity to come into the YMCA and fill out an application for our scholarship program, and that will benefit them just not for today, but for the rest of their life to instill those principles. Absolutely. I want to know, what was it like last year? Because it's a little cold, <laughs> but tomorrow, I mean, we'll be in the 60s. Yes, yeah, so last year it was a little chilly. Uh, it was about 40 degrees with a nice rain. Uh, yes, we are expecting some beautiful weather at 60 degrees in our glorious state of Texas, and we're looking forward to all the participants who are going to be taking that plunge. Okay, how many people were here last year? Last year we had 65. 65. How many do we anticipate tomorrow? Hopefully 75 and up. Wow, 75 and up. So maybe we'll go ahead and add Barry to that list as well. Maybe Sarah too. So this is happening tomorrow morning yes. at what time? 10 a.m. 10 a.m. So we'll be in the 60s and it might not be too bad to take a little plunge tomorrow. I know the sun will be out. We'll be back in the 70s for the afternoon. Yes. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, one of us is going to take a plunge in the pool <laughs> later on this morning. So you guys are going to have to stick around to find out if it's going to be me or not. And it might just be Barry if we can get him out here in time. I Come like, on, Barry. I like how when Maggie earlier said, um, yeah, I'd like to see Barry do it. It was like crickets. Like I, uh, yeah, well, I, didn't hear, I didn't hear her say it. I, I was going to tell her, you know, Maggie, if you'll jump in, Sarah will. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. You know what? Maybe I'll tell you this. I'm going to choose a time to do it right now while the weather is actually not so polar. Right. Yeah. This is the time, this is a good time. I would brave it. Yeah.